Uh, so, Menace, where are we at? You've had this uh, goal to get to 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. Yeah, and uh, we are pretty close. Let me look for Six the, months yeah. later, here we are. <laughs> well, he, he, he had said eight we were, years later. Yeah, because he had said that we were super close, what, yeah. two, three months ago. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And so we've been uh, just every once in a while checking in. Yeah, we're at... 98,600. Ooh. Okay. 98,600. So, okay. 1,400. All right. So we're, we're, we're almost there. Now, if, mm-hmm. so in that three months, we've gotten halfway from where we were. Yeah. Okay. Creeping up. <laughs> mm-hmm. We're creeping up. We're almost there. Yeah. And so this is, um, it's an ongoing discussion, you know, um, just in general. And you get a plaque for this? We yeah. Have yeah. We have one in the studio. We have Cartnarks. one for Cartin Arts. Mm-hmm. And I okay. thought this would be a good opportunity to uh, teach you guys how to YouTube as a professional. <laughs> as someone who has like five times the number of uh, uh, subscribers for Cartoon Arcs, yes. not only on YouTube, but other platforms. Uh-huh. Yeah. I thought I'd teach you guys how to do social media and how to YouTube <laughs> with some examples of people who have more subscribers than the yeah. we showed. Right, this, is an on, this is an ongoing feature that we've been doing. Yes. Just to point out, like, it shouldn't be as difficult as it is. And right. my, my thing is, like, I don't want to resort to cheap ploys. To, you know what I mean? Like Thank there's so, there are so many there are so many places that do that kind of Ravy stuff. Ravy just says that because the one idea that we had involved <laughs> feet. I know. Not we. So you, this, yeah. You. yeah. 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 No. And it, which, and, would, would it be funny? Yes, it would yeah. be funny. But it's also let's be honest, it's a, it's a, it is a cheap ploy. That'll get us fourteen hundred cravers. You know. I'll, look, I'll I'll share I'm the idea. To, that I'm, not, I'm not here to argue the. Uh, oh, the no, I don't. Even, it was. I it don't was need to argue. Be it. Judging feet. Yeah, it was. Guess that foot. That was yeah. all it was going to be. It was <laughs> yeah, going to be yeah. hilarious. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, What's wrong with that. Either way, I. You know, and every time these conversations about social media and followers and mm-hmm. engagement and all this kind of stuff yeah. come up, like I have to now because the people that we have, I would rather. Mm-hmm. I would rather honestly. I would rather have say twenty thousand super really passionate mm-hmm. into it, passionate. Mm-hmm. You know, people who just love the who show engage. and. And who just want to consume as much as they can of the show, rather than a hundred thousand uh, followers of people mm-hmm. who don't care, aren't paying. To, they follow because they're trying to win a contest or something like like just these things that like they're not necessarily hardcore. Right. You or know, they're waiting for into, the next foot video. Yeah, in, into the <laughs> yeah. show. I find I would think, yeah. and isn't that true? Like in the social media world, isn't that much more valuable to have? It's people definitely like more that? valuable. Valuable. valuable if you're uh, valuable. <laughs> Yeah, now, if you're selling sucks. a product or something like that, For yeah, sure. extremely valuable. Here's what sucks: if any of us had this idea that we were like this huge, awesome show, uh-huh. this is a reminder of your place in the universe. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I, and I don't say that in a way uh, like, look, everybody here, we all have great lives. You know what I mean? And we have a level of success, but we are never going to be that stratosphere we're never going to be secrets yeah. you know and i'm fine with that oh, i've God. known so many people and there's in fact there's a guy that i'm thinking about right now he uh ended up doing some tv stuff but he wanted to be carson daly now this is when carson daly was doing trl and everything else and he always compared himself and measured himself mm. by that mm. and he was just never going to be that That's guy an but impossible he, task he ended yeah. up being on national television but was he as big as carson daly no and once he kind of realized that i'm never going to be that big he was able to readjust his priorities, and he's become a much happier person. And his name mm-hmm. was Regis Philbin. <laughs> yeah. All right. By the way, this is somebody that we all know. Mm-hmm. This is all. This is somebody that we all know, and uh, he he just became a much happier person. And look, uh, you know, I, I've said it a million times. Like I don't, uh, I don't have any, yeah, you know, I don't, I don't mm-hmm. have any great amount of uh, self esteem really at all. <laughs> like, uh, I'm, no, I'm you're sitting, in the negative. I'm sitting yeah. here every day, and when things are good. Mm-hmm. I was just talking about this recently with the uh, the therapist. It's like you know I was trying to get him to understand like when the better things are, the more nervous I right. get. You would think you'd be more calm and whatever. You have the, the other more shoe relaxed. Yeah. yeah. When things are good, I'm uncomfortable because I'm waiting for that shoe to drop. When things aren't going so great, or when we're taking forever to get yeah. to a hundred thousand subscribers, I'm mm-hmm. actually feeling pretty good. Okay. I know it sounds weird. We'll wait to hear what Seabass has to say. This is why I think this is funny because. As much as we're doing, trying to get to a hundred thousand, because yeah. it'll it'll make Menace happy, and yeah. if it makes Menace happy, and we can get this stupid uh, <laughs> plaque or whatever, that's great. Well, yeah, and let me explain it why it also is so difficult because the shareable content factor. Like we make content for our listeners to watch and enjoy, but do they often reshare it? They don't, so that's why yeah. 
cares it takes about a little anything. bit longer to yeah. hit that one hundred thousand. Yeah. Uh, like, no, I'm just trying to explain. All of this preamble of how we aren't yeah. successful is good, but I think it's yeah. going to help to the lesson we're about to go to. Okay, these, these yes. are people. Nice. Who yes. have. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Over hundred thousand. Yeah. We uh we asked Seabass to uh, find some people here, who uh, oh. <laughs> we asked some uh, find some people here who have a hundred thousand subscribers or more. All right. And Menace, what you sort of hit on there is what mm-hmm. a lot of the secret here is to being a good YouTuber. Specialization okay. and yes. shareable stuff. Mm-hmm. What we do is, a, most of it anyways, is a general talk show, general stuff, which is fine yes. and lovely. Yeah. For our listeners. But, yeah. It's yeah. what we do. But it's not exactly yeah. specialized and interesting. And that's where someone like the Real Housewives of Tarot comes in. <laughs> nice. <Yeah>. Tarot. <laughs> this is what? Molly. With, and his, this is for Sammy. With, Eat this crap up. <laughs> this is Molly. She's about a four, a uh, real housewife, or not a real mm-hmm. housewife, but a housewife who does mm-hmm. tarot readings. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to la- play a clip from her, and then you guys. Oh, we have a clip. Oh, oh. Yeah, oh so I obviously. didn't know we had clips. I well, thought we were just giving examples. Yeah. We're, not, we're, not just, we're not just telling. We're showing. Mm-hmm. Oh, so this, this is, is her. She's doing a reading uh, about four Capricorn, Sammy. Okay. And a Capricorn's love life. And she's going to kind of explain, though, that yeah, while this is a Capricorn love reading, this could be applicable in many other ways. Now, do we oh. get uh, do we get to find out how many followers she has, or is this like kind of we guess later? You, you guess right now. I don't care. Um, Let's listen to the Real Housewives I, I of Tarot. I need to hear it first. Yes. All right, here we go. Keep in mind, the roles can be reversed. Even though I'm directly talking to you, Capricorn, I could actually be talking to the Crotch Watcher. Okay. What? <laughs> Energy is interchangeable. If your sun sign of Cappy does not resonate, check your moon, rising, weenus, and make sure weenus. to Crotch Watch. <laughs> What's that? People crotch? go Crotch Watch. Crosswatch. Ah. All right, Capricorn. What's that? Dealing the tarot cards. Capricorn. Okay, so I definitely feel like there's been a lack of success. Okay, in some type of area with someone. Did we tap right, out? Due to them being. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right. The point <laughs> is, tap out, wow. please. The point is this. Five? The point is this chick has more YouTube subscribers than we do. Yeah. Right, it's not just okay. her and her and mom. And by the way, that goes on for 35 Jeez. minutes of her I talking about... I think we just about, heard the whole thing. Oh of her God. talking about, well, you have some sort of thing in your life that's sort of vague, but also if you're not a Capricorn, this could apply to you because... Because Tarot's fake! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> it's garbage and Sorry, they're Sammy. intentionally uh, vague. Yeah. All right, so uh, the nonsense. Real Housewives of Tarot, she's blowing the uh, the Woody Show Ooh. away with how many subscribers would you guys say? Mm. 140,000? I would 40. say... Because of the subject, maybe two hundred thousand. I was gonna say two hundred. Yeah. yeah, put me down with menace. Menace. Let's say two fifty. I read the expert Sammy. Uh, I'll say about one sixty-five. Oh my God! And Sammy almost nails it. One hundred sixty-three thousand. Wow. Wow. wow! wow! Oh yeah, my that's Molly. God! That's Molly again. Yeah, that's what she, she sits in her <laughs> kitchen and pretends to know what random oh cards God. mean <laughs> and just says garbage for one hundred and sixty-three thousand <laughs> subscribers. Yeah. Probably is making at least six figures off yeah. of this wow. garbage YouTube Damn. channel. Damn. And in the month and a half since, uh, you know, whatever, we've gotten, what, 1,500 <laughs> subscribers? <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, by the way, if you want to subscribe, it's YouTube.com slash The Woody Show. Everybody knows how, yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's what it was. Maybe people just didn't yeah, know. Yeah, we just they didn't know the URL. Yeah. Yeah. All right, who else has uh, more subscribers than The Woody Show? This is for you, Greg Gorey. This is a channel on YouTube that all they do is is they break down, you know, the logic and reasoning in Harry Potter books. Oh, oh sweet. So I know, and Greg, oh God, it's like every week we hear about this. Ravy just signed up. It's like, yes. He's like, Greg, it's uh-huh. like, how did Dumbledore block Avacadabra right. when- uh, Aveda Kedavra. Yeah, Aveda Kedavra. Yeah. Yes. When, how? When Sn- Snigglypuss shot Wait, at dude, him and Harry Potter. How did he Potter. avoid a cadaver? How did he, how did how? he break that? That doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. So you think about Aveda Kedavra. Like, you can deflect it. Well, that's the thing. And this is this video from uh, Harry Potter Theory is the name of the channel. <laughs> will tell you, Greg, the answer <laughs> to your longstanding question. At one point in their epic battle, Voldemort attempts to use Avada Kedavra on Harry. <gasps> However, what is unusual about this segment is that Dumbledore is able to successfully prevent Harry from being hit by it. This is interesting, because we first learn about the properties of Avada Kedavra in the Goblet of Fire. In class, Moody, actually Barty Crouch Jr., is teaching the class about the unforgivable curses, and clearly states that there is no way to fend off the killing curse. A common counter spell that one might use would be something like Protego, 
In the case of the killing I'm curse, however, <laughs> it would go straight through the shield arm and serve as no protection to the caster. <laughs> so, what a dork. Hey, Greg, I, adults pay attention yeah, to this. I just looked at our analytics. Uh, Ravy has unsubscribed to the Woody Show page and oh, has yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> subscribed to and this. And subscribed to Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got so much love to go around. So this is Harry Potter. That's oh basically their videos where they take little, little uh, tidbits from the fictional made-up world inside of some British woman's brain <laughs> and break it down for you as if it's that anything. transfer, by the way, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. wow. So they have many more subscribers than the Woody Show on that YouTube. Is so depressing. How many? It, it, oh, they oh. probably have a ton more. Yeah, I would say. <sighs> I'm gonna. Can I guess first? Yes. I'm gonna say. <laughs> One point two million. <laughs> One point two million. <laughs> yeah. Ravy. I mean, breaking down books. Uh, probably like. Five hundred thousand, because there is a lot of yeah. I'm sure there's, there's so many Harry pages. Potter a lot of I'm right? Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. sticking with my other I'm, I'm, guess too of two hundred thousand. Two hundos. I'm going yeah. three hundred. I'll go three fifty. I think Ravi is the closest. Six hundred and fifteen thousand. Wow. <laughs> yeah. We'll watch that, that garbage and, and yeah. one. This is interesting. Yeah, yeah check it out. Nice. To I know. And oh, wow. Subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and at least one... get Ravi to read a book on on camera or something. Well, no. Of course. Uh, mm -mm. No actors, no Nothing. JK on there. Just one subject, yeah. and just some yeah. Yeah. <laughs> read some passages from Harry Potter, oh, yeah. and like oh, Will yeah. Ravy oh. cry. Yeah. All right. But would you do a topless? <laughs> With oh. my boobs out. <laughs> yeah. See, that's the cheap ploys. You see yeah. what I'm saying? Yep. Can we do like, a cheap ploy? Apparently, you don't even need that but, stuff unless you're us. By the way, right. that's every Twitch, every other Twitch streamer, which is bit playing video games essentially. Is, is, like is a 19 year old girl with her boobs out oh. essentially who's pretending that oh I'm such a dork look at me tee -hee -hee -hee, give we me money. make fun but they're making more than we are yep. All right. so Menace is uh, grinding out here like there's no tomorrow trying to get to 100,000 <laughs> meanwhile meanwhile Greg mm -hmm. there are tons of interior design YouTube oh, channels I watch them and every single one <laughs> is uh, it seems like is hosted by the most basic bitch in the world like just like rando stay at home 28 year old housewife this is uh, Kristen McGowan. She got her bachelor's of interior design. Okay. And she's ready to share all her home decor DIY and lifestyle tips and tricks, Sweet. including this one. This is uh, called 10 Ways to Make Your Home Look More Expensive. Nice. <laughs> Parentheses design hacks. She doesn't yeah. know what hacks look mean. more expensive. Oh, okay. This is a hack. Yeah, this is a hack. This is how you, you figure it out that no one else can do it. This is Kristen McGowan. My name's Kristen, and today I'm going to be sharing with you 10 decorating tips to make your home look more luxurious and expensive. Ooh. Now, one rug type that you'll notice in almost every high-end design is a good runner. Runners are very overlooked, and I think they make such an impact to small spaces like hallways, kitchens, bathrooms, and entryways. Runners are an absolute must. I get a lot of my gorgeous runners from Walmart because they have some of my favorite <laughs> things yeah, girl. at such a great price. Okay. Uh, so I, runners are those big long rugs. I have a runner on. in my kitchen. Those big long rugs. Yeah, I have yeah. a runner in my kitchen. Do you agree? They're hard that, to find. Is that, a way to, is that one of the 10 ways to make your house look more expensive? I feel like no. I hacked my kitchen. With his <laughs> runner. With a nice runner. <laughs> yeah, like a tip, a trick, not, uh, not, not even a trick, not a trick. A piece of oh. advice is not a hack. I mean, they knock Walmart, but I'm I'm saying the Gap collection at Walmart is pretty nice. Are there some dope-ass runners? I yeah. think runners are hard to find. I would have never well, tried to look Walmart. at Walmart. Oh, oh, okay. Some, uh, so home decor is. news, uh, yeah. Greg Gore. Apparently, Banana Republic is opening up like uh, a new <gasps> a, a new store, yeah, with Homeline stuff. Oh, yeah. Great. All right, Greg. So she, this girl, Kristen, mm. with her... Uh, Basic bitch home decor tips that you could be doing better, but quite frankly, See, I like watching the architectural digest ones. Well, that's professional. This is right. some rando. This is just rando lady. Way more subscribers than the Woody Show. Um, I mean, I mean, way, way more. more. Okay, right. about two hundred and ten. Okay, put me down for six hundred thousand. Ooh. Ooh, I'm going seven hundred. I'll say three hundred. What does she look like? Three uh, fifty. The most like just basic twenty eight year old housewife mm. wannabe. She cute or no? Uh, well, no, she's actually she's Woody cute because she's very. Brunette girl next door look. Ah, okay. oh, I think I'll, yeah, I'll stick with 600. <laughs> 1.63 million. What? Wow. Damn, son. Oh. Holy crap. Wow. That's a, have, have a day, day job. And her advice is buy a rug at Walmart. Menace, wow. if you're doing the math, that's 1.5 million more than what we've <laughs> got. Yep. It's actually more than that. she's talking about mm. runners in the kitchen. Yeah. Ugh. It's oh, more she's, than 1.6 million more. She's right. taking home some good cheddar. Each month off wow. YouTube. And, she, and yeah. on top of that, that's a paid Walmart insert, I'm sure. Yeah, what do you... um? What do you make on 1.5 million subscribers? Uh, well, um, the subscribers geez. aren't again. The subscribers aren't what you make money on. You yeah, make money views. on views, but but okay. subscribers lead to views. Sure. 
and it's about a dollar per thousand views. Roughly a dollar per thousand. So if she's getting, let's say she's doing one point six million, let's say views per year, you know, just divide that by a thousand. So that's one hundred sixty something thousand. Huh. Wow. All right. But then again, you good for her. But in, in her, but yeah. then but she can the add Walmart, and then yeah. she's probably getting stuff off. Instagram and TikTok as well. Right, there's all product buying. Other retailers and stuff. She's probably pulling in like 500,000 minimum. 